Voice of Indonesia. In the Lunar New Year, the markets are bursting with traditional Imlek foods. But what do they mean? And most importantly, which Imlek food reigns supreme? Hi, I'm Maddie Toth from Voice of Indonesia, and here I am at the Glodok Markets in Jakarta. This markets are alive with bright red decorations and and locals preparing for the busy 15 days ahead. I'm here to have a chat with fellow market goers, try some of their food and answer some burning questions. Today I'm exploring the Glodok markets with some friends at Voice of Indonesia to find out what foods are traditionally served this time of year. Uh, yeah, kue keranjang. Yeah. And which one they'd recommend most. <laughs> Lunar New Year, or Tahun Baru Imlek, is a time for family honoring deities and ancestors and bringing good luck and prosperity for the new year ahead. One of the most common ways to ensure a good year is through food. Foods traditionally served this time of year are often symbolic of long life, abundance and good luck. The Chinese New Year cake, you can see it out the front. They have a round shape. Also the egg roll, you know the one? Well, with Chinese cooking and the Chinese menu, there are many things to eat. It really depends on what you like. So we're on the way to try some kue karanjang, which uh, translates to cake of the basket. Um, and it's a traditional rice cake that is served around this time of year for Chinese New Year. Kue karanjang is a Lunar New Year must-have. The round shape is symbolic of being together with family and maintaining the harmony for life. The soft and chewy texture represents persistence and the sweet flavour is symbolic of life's joys and blessings. So much meaning in such a tiny cake. Very rich. Yeah. And very dense. Very sweet. This is definitely one to share with your friends. Yeah. Maddie Toth, the voice of Indonesia, from Indonesia to the world.